The statewide housing market continued its hot streak last month, setting new records for pending and under contract properties and median sales price, while the inventory of active listings and month supply of inventory for single family homes fell to record low statewide, according to the latest monthly housing data from the Colorado Association of Realtors. I'm John Grant, and this is your Coldwell Banker Rep Real Estate Market Update. in the past four months, the number of pending homes in Colorado hit a new record high. The 11,621 single-family homes and 3,759 townhomes and condos under contract statewide in August represent a more than 40% increase over August 2019. Although 13,500 new listings helped offset the continued strong demand from buyers, it was not nearly enough to keep the median pricing for single-family homes from hitting an all-time statewide high at $450,000, as well as an all-time high for the seven-county Denver metro area at $492,500, up 11% from last year. Further complicating market conditions, August delivered a nearly 50% dip in the inventory of active listings across the state. 15,358 compared to 29,115 in August 2019. The numbers also pushed the month's supply of inventory down another 20% to 1.5 months. That figure is down more than 50% from a year ago and sets a new record low for single family homes statewide. In Broomfield, homeowners are deciding if they can't be in the home they love, love the home they're with. They are sitting tight, hunkering down, and not listing their homes for sale. Remodeling their current homes is a popular trend as they try to navigate working and schooling from home. Listings are down between 10 and 15 percent from the beginning of the year, causing an inventory shortage for those buyers who are anxious to move and take advantage of low interest rates. The imbalance of supply and demand has caused prices to rise 4% from the beginning of the year. Homes that are priced right and show well are selling in a speedy 29 days here in Broomfield. Bidding wars here are the norm, which is an unusual situation for a pro fall pre-election market. The typical fall slowdown is not being seen in these areas as our real estate trends are anything but typical in this interesting year. The bottom line is that the real estate market is in a unique place. Historically low interest rates are increasing buyer activity while low inventory is benefiting sellers with higher purchase prices. If you're in the market to buy or sell a home, remember professional and honest advice is just a phone call away. I'm John Grant with Cobalt Banker Rep Real Estate and I will see you next time.